Hey guys, this is Dungeon Master 201, and I'm ready to continue my adventure through the land of Hoenn. Today we're going to be going through Route 120, as we do not have the current ability to go to the gym, as something is blocking our path. There's something up here. Let's see what it is. <clears throat> and it's a rare candy. Very nice. Let's go over here. And it's the reporter again. Leave me alone, you reporter. Uh, how about I just tell you, uh, I don't know, uh, dragon. You reporting, you blood-sucking, life-draining reporters. Always telling the bad news and nothing good. And there's something over here. Let's go check it out. If I can ever get through this grass without running into these annoying wilds. And there, once again, there's something blocking my way. Hey, Steven! Oh, thank you. Ah, so it's Kekulon that's been blocking my path. Okay, I thought for a second that it was, uh, one of the evil teams doing something to block my path. And now we can actually go check out that gym, but since I'm already here at Route 120... Well, that was interesting. I'm going to continue moving my way toward, uh, uh, exploring Route 120 since I'm already here. And I'll go back to Fortreet City to deal with that gym later. And that looks like part of that Fortree City over there. And it looks like a couple of trainers. Four of them, from what I can see. Man, I really did some damage to myself. Ooh, cast one. That thing's gonna change. Cast form changes its uh, appearance depending on the weather. Soon I'll be at level sixty eight. It's not really good camouflage, because I can see you. And 
what's this? Oops, wrong button. There we go. Revive. Sobly. And it fakes me out. Protects itself like a little bitch. Man, I think I need to replace Peck at one time. Come on, your death is inevitable. Hey, there's something over here. Let's check it out. Oh, berries. That looks like another secret tree. Looks like we're in a maze here. And a ranger. And Nuzzly. Let us continue through this, uh, natural maze. Well, I hope there's something in my way. Really? And another, uh, freaking Keculon. This is what you get for being in my way. Yeah, it looks like another trainer. Man, that fake out is really getting annoying. And Lumbre. Use up some of these super potions. Oh, wow, rare candy from Leon. That's a first. And what's this? A nugget? Oh, wow, it's another five grand. You know, in the uh, Pokemon world, the money is based off of the Japanese yen. Hence why is everything so expensive. Uh, unlike most currencies, the, uh, the Japanese yen doesn't have a decimal system. It's just one yen or two yen, two hundred yen. It's just yen, not cents or whatever the equivalent is. Which is why a Pokeball is two hundred dollars, but it's actually yen. Which I spent about a year and a half in uh, Japan, and when I was there, one American dollar was, I think it was like about on average about 120 yen. Now it's like terrible from what uh, some of my friends have been telling me. Man, is that a trainer? No, it's not. And we get the Wolverine. Let's check these out. Petcha berries, which cure poisoning. More peacha berries. And another couple of peacha berries. No, I don't want the plant right now, so I'll forget about it. Woo! Raspberry. Another trainer.
Sand true. <clears throat> and sand slash. So let's slash this slash. And this is the other place where we can find the third legendary golem. Which right now we cannot access until we do something else. Ooh, hey, Abyssal. Ah, damn it. Oh well. I'll come back later. Let's check out this river or lake. Anything over here? Yes! So we have a full heal, which my guy picks up on its own anyway. I like the clouding effect. Anything over here? No. Man, that reflection's really nice. Let's see. Alright, we're now on Route 121. Let us continue. Beautifly. Oh wow, I ran out of moves for that. <clears throat> oh wow, some more berries. And I'm now level 69. And we get another Pokenab number. Prismberry. Asperberry. Frostberry. And. Chestoberry. Let us continue. Oh, hey, Team Aqua? To move out to Mount Cry. Hmm, looks like I'm going to be making my way toward Mount Fry. And there's another secret base. And a couple of more trainers. And it looks like it's a safari zone. Oops. There we go, we got it just in time before I fell asleep. And another secret tree up there. Man, I am really running out of uh, moves. Damn breeders. What's this guy? Another breeder.
And we get a revive. And this guy, and we gotta go all the way around just to get that item. What a fan. Ah, paralysis. Now we get another uh, Pokemon number bag. Where is that paralysis heal? Because it seems like my guys uh, catch paralysis at like the drop of a dime. Another repel. And we get a uh, Carbos, which increases speed. Oh wow, shop it. And let's talk to this person. Ah, uh, Pikachu. Hayunke! Man, I get paralyzed again, see? Anything up here? Let's check out. No. Oops. There we go. A nugget. Let's check out over here. There's obviously something in that uh, loose space. And Vigoro. <sighs> yep, Max Revive. Wow, that's actually useful. Now we get Nam Nam Berries. Anything up there? No. Okay. Now we've made it to Lily Cove City. Now, um, I'm gonna bring an end to this episode, and the next, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna find out what Team Aqua was uh, talking about uh, when it comes to a uh, Mount Cry before heading in that direction. So, uh, if you like my videos, all I ask is you hit the like, and if you haven't, subscribe to me. That's all. It's not really that difficult. So, until next time. <laughs>